Hey guys, Juju Bear here. Welcome back to the channel. And we are here in 2016 playing some more Total War Rome 2. Always a pleasure to be bringing these games to you. I am playing as Rome, which is something of a rarity, but uh, it is because of my opponent that I am playing as Rome. Now I'm playing against uh, Johann Gottlieb Fichter. I think he changed his name recently. And he seems to be a bit of a, um, a swaby master, I guess you could say. So his build here, he's got four of these Germanic Scout Riders. Uh, Swordmaster General, one Germanic Slinger, a, uh, I think it's a Noble Horse, four of these Berserkers, three Club Levy, uh, four of these Spear, hang on a second, let me just check this out, uh, four of these Spear Levy, one, two, three, four, and a couple of Woden House Spears, he's got one over here, and he's got one over here, so, kind of a split up, uh, I'll just put it into slow motion here for a second, so a bit of a split up uh, formation that he's gone for here, the last time we played against each other, uh, he was contracted into a small formation, and I had um, three of these um, wider formations. I'll put a link to that game in the top left-hand corner up here. So this time, I am coming as the uh, as the Romans, as, a, as opposed to the Pontics. Uh, this will be a little bit more um, classic. I'll, I'll have to play a little bit more uh, of the infantry gameplay than I usually do. Uh, so you can see I'm trying to basically put my units in these in these woods a little bit. Uh, just refusing my opponent uh, any shots into most of my units. Just once I get into a tight formation, I'll just show you my my uh, makeup here. So I've got one, two, three, four armored legionaries and one, two, three, four Vakadi cohort. Bringing up the front, I've got three of these Vigilis. They're going to be, uh, they're kind of just going to be um, big old big old targets for, for the enemy Oriovistus charge. Uh, with that fast charge and the uh, pride unlocked, you know, you can get some pretty nasty uh, charge bonuses. So hopefully when he does charge into me, these Vigiles would will uh, kind of bear the brunt of most of those attacks. Uh, bringing up the on the rears, uh, on the flanks, sorry, I've got levies. <clears throat> Just very cheap units. Hopefully um, hold up the enemy units and throw some uh, some uh, javelins into the fray. I've got an Ecrote on each flank uh, and a Bleric Slinger. And I've also got in the center an, another Balearic Slinger and a Levy. The so three Levies, three uh, Balearic Slingers, and a General and Bodyguard unit. Now, I I know a lot of people don't tend to use uh, Cavalry Testudo, but I, I believe this is probably one of the only appropriate times when you can't chase after an enemy, but they're definitely going to try and uh, take some shots at you. So I'm actually facing the wrong direction here. Good work, Juju Bear. Might be a glitch in the replay. <laughs> We'll just put it down as a glitch in the replay. It's definitely not my fault. Um, so what I'm doing here is I'm going to try and single out uh, one portion of his army. Just completely disregard these two parts. But as soon as I do that, he can kind of see what I'm doing. And I think he's going to start pulling away with his units here. Yeah, indeed he does. So that's when he comes in with his uh, Germanic Scout Riders. I'm going to defend my Balearic Slingers with my own Equites. And get some fairly good shots off with my own, uh, my own Slingers. I've got one kill there, and probably done a fair bit of HP damage. We've got another kill over there. So these um, scout riders will probably start to drop fairly quickly. I'm just going to put it in forward here, just until we get into the fray, because we do just kind of move around for a little bit. So in the center, he does have his blood swarm, which are going to kind of do the brunt of his uh, killing uh, with the uh, Oriovisus uh, fast charge general's ability, and the swordmaster in the center with two spear levy and Germanic slinger to soak up missiles probably um, so I haven't really lost too many units I mean I've lost three equites over on that flank I haven't lost any on this flank and he is probably running out of quite a few javelins at this point I don't know if yeah I can't remember exactly how many um volleys I have noble riders is the is the unit he's gonna run in and try and intercept me but I'm gonna pull my units back and engage him with my own um, equites just to hold him up I'm going to throw in a couple of Armored Legionaries. He does manage to catch my levies here, but thankfully I get my Balearic Slingers out of there. Uh, quick smart. I don't really care too much for those levies, uh, which is why they were kind of out in the fray, but he's sending in his spe uh, Spear Levy into this uh, fight. He has lost quite a few of these Noble Riders. Um, I don't know if that was really worth it for him, though I did lose my uh, Equite unit. So down by 40 men, and it was a little bit late with the um, the support there, so probably a good, a good job for my opponent there. Did a fairly nice job. Um, I noticed the threat. He has just popped 
uh, fast charge. So the speed and the charge bonus on these units is going to be pretty, pretty intense. I can stand up to these charges. Um, but what I'm going to do is actually do a bit of a swap. I'm going to take one Vigili up the back to defend my, my rear. And avoid any Germanic Scout Rider attacks. And bring a couple of my um, Armored Legionaries up the front. So, we're bearing the brunt of the, uh, of the charge up the front with my Vigiles. And I'm going to add in with my, my, um, my own units later on. We are engaging on this flank over here. We'll probably win these, um, these engagements fairly, fairly easily here. We did lose a Vigilia over on that flank. This Armored Legionary is... Um, is surrounded and starting to get destroyed. He's down to 75 men there, so not doing such a great job. This Vigile was going to die. It was always going to die. So I'm going to send in my second line of these Armored Legionaries. We are losing with this other Vigile. Didn't really expect it to win either. Um, so at the moment, I'm running quite low on infantry. Um, I'm blobbing up a little bit over on this flank, which is not great. Um, and up the rear, I've only got Evicardi co Evicardi Cohort to, to defend against these uh, Germanic Scout Riders. Nice jab toss there, if I do say so myself. Um, I'm going to turn around my Evicardi Cohort and just hold, refuse my flank, make sure that he can't throw javelins into my rear. Uh, one of these levies is, is, I think it's getting focus fired on by that Germanic Slinger. And now it's focus firing in on my Equites here. My other Auxiliary Balearic Slingers is going to fire into these Bloodsworn and finish them off. Uh, these Berserkers over on this flank are just... Absolutely rorting a lot of my units. Lots of kills there on those every cutting cohort. He's actually going to sandwich these uh, levies. Not before I get a few, a couple of good shots on the on the enemy. I'm going to follow him in with my Evicardi cohort. Uh, Balearic slingers. Let's see how many kills they get at, the, at this point. So only seven and thirteen. So not really using my units to the best of their ability just yet. These Balearic slingers getting some very nice shots into these blood swan at the rear. He is focus firing on my generals and bodyguard. I'm going to have to use that unit to hold off a lot of his um the enemies. Because he, he does have, I think it's the, yeah, here we go. Germanic Scout Rider getting into my Balearic Slingers. This is exactly what I do not want. Um, Going to face off with his uh, Blood Sworn. It does have Pride uh, pop there. So set 27 weapon damage and most of that's going to be um, armor piercing. This is a pretty good engage from, engagement for me. Um, blobbed up with his units and my units are actually going to beast out a win in, in, in that little engagement if um, it stays the same. Getting some good hits on these Blood Sworn. Just trying to free up my Avocati cohort so I can go and pursue one of these Spear Levy. Uh, because I am being pursued, um, I do have a lot of these skirmishes left, but we did deal with the uh, the threat of these Germanic Scout Riders already. So, Intercept with the uh, Avocati cohort, going to hold up a lot of these enemy units. Uh, though I have lost a Balearic Slinger, which is not great. So I'm going to get my Avocati cohort that did survive and go into these Word Nest Spears. They're going to be a very tough opponent for me. I'm going to turn around. Uh, he's going to pull out of that engagement and then try and send in these Blood Swan. Gets a very nice uh, shot of Javelins off there. And you can see what he's doing very intelligently, pulling away and then attacking from a different direction. Just trying to surround me at this point. Uh, almost racking up the kills. 30 kills with these levies. 14 with that levy. And I got 14 kills in this Balearic Slinger. It's definitely not enough. Uh, 44 from this Balearic Slinger. Did come back from routing. Just trying to finish off this Berserk unit. And we've got another Balearic Slinger over here on 93 kills. So doing a pretty good job. Uh, all in all. This uh, Word Nest Spear is actually doing fairly well against my Evicardi cohort. Going to win that engagement. Over here on this flank, we got Armored Legionnaires. Come on, getting a, a double XP Silver Chevron. Um, lots of kills there. I'm going to have to catch up to these, these units here because he's um, just chasing off my, my own uh, skirmishes. But you can see I'm just kiting, pulling back, getting away and taking more shots. I do have my gen generals. Oh, I don't know what's going in there. I think my levies were actually out of ammo. There we go. So they're going to hold up the enemies while I get some nice uh, flank shots. Getting this Balearic Slinger to, to shoot into the flank. It's working quite well. We are managing to destroy that uh, Spear Levy there. Uh, he does manage to catch my Balearic Slingers. I don't know if they were on skirm. I don't actually remember them being there. So I think that's a bit of a replay. Yeah, I don't remember that. That's kind of bizarre. Anyway, in the center, Evicardi Cohort coming up against these Bloodsworn. 46 men left. These Evicardi Cohort are going to attack these Swordmasters. And they're getting a bit of help from these Armored Legionnaires. So hopefully we can bring down those sword masters before the end of the match. Berserkers coming up against my own um, armored legionnaires. Very annoying unit. Down to four units. They're exhausted and they're still going. Going to be very difficult to get rid of. All the while, my Balearic Sling is getting some very nice shots into the rear of the Spear Levy. Uh, going to have to try and keep trying to pull away. My general and bodyguard's still in the fight. I actually haven't lost him yet. <laughs> Even though there's only uh, five units left in that general's and bodyguard unit. So fairly tough at this point. Very hard to see who's going to win this. It's a very, very, very close game. This Spear Levy, 43 men left. 
They are doing so great. Steady, their casualties sustained. They're being attacked in the rear, taking fire, all those sorts of uh, penalties. Uh, these Germanic Slingers getting some very nice shots on my Balearic Slingers. It's too bad that I can't, I can't deal with that. But it looks like we are engaging these uh, Swordmasters and they are losing this current combat. Though just in time, he actually gets his blood sworn in and takes out my Armored Legionnaires with 13 men left. Uh, casualty sustained. I don't know if the General has just died here. But um, it looks like he's just popped, yeah, Shield Wall. Don't know if that's going to help him out, really. I do have my Armored Legionnaires uh, working working some magic, magic on his um, Wednesday Spears. We did manage to route that Spear Levy over on this flank over here. And I've got my General's Bodyguard, two Balearic Slingers, uh, Evercardi Cohort, and another Armored Legionnaire with 40, 41 men left. Very difficult to see what's going to happen here, but he does get a nice rear charge in here with his, uh, with his Blood Sworn. So I just don't have enough units to kind of support uh, my own engagement. So... Nice, nice sandwich there from my opponent. Johan did a really great job of uh, surrounding and destroying me. Um, at this point, it's looking a little bit like I'm not going to win this match. He's got a Germanic Slinger, which is going to soak up all of my fire. It really could just take the rest of the ammo from these Balearic Slingers and just provide a real pain. Um, and I'm outmatched and outnumbered in the center here. Every card to go, even though they've got, they've got five... Uh, f uh, 48 men left, 139 kills. They're just not going to stand up to these Wedden Aspi and uh, Bloodsworn, as they do have 50 men left, respectively. And we got fucking Berserkers coming to the fight. Jesus Christ, they ever go up. Let's just follow these guys into battle here. Look at them go. Two men left, and they're still stabbing Romans. Jesus. <laughs> Frenzy and, and, uh, and Headhunt popped at the end there, and the Spear Levy actually came back. And it's at that point that I lose all my men and um, a costly enemy victory in, 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 uh, ensues. So SH, Johan, very good game from him. Um, we we have a lot of kills on these Berserkers. They lasted a lot longer than I than I really hoped they would. These were nest spears, actually very impressive. I think that was one of them was one, the one that was uh, pursuing my Balearic Slingers, but not really utilizing my, my Balearic Slingers properly. And I did take the, the full brunt of the um, the charge with a lot of my uh, armored legionaries and cohorts, Evercardi cohorts. So if I used my uh, Vigiles like I said I would, then I probably would have made a bit more of a dent in the opponent there. Probably should have brought just a, a few more Hastati actually. Maybe four Hastati, get rid of um, one of the armored legionnaire or something like that. I probably would have done quite a good job on him. But anyway, thanks for the game, bro. Uh, 2016, we're here. I'm going to be bringing out a lot more of these Total War Rome 2 online battles, so stay tuned for more. Peace.